Hello again, and welcome back to the Convection Connection. Today, in Episode 3, we'll explore the gigantic forces that can be produced by air pressure. Can you guess the size of air pressure? Well, at sea level, air pressure is about 15 pounds per square inch. However, here in the Denver area, we are one mile above sea level, and the air pressure is a little less, uh, uh, a little more than 12 pounds per square inch. So on every square inch of our bodies, there's a force of 12 pounds pushing inward. So why don't we feel this tremendous pressure? It's because the pressure is pushing on us evenly from all sides, even from our insides due to the air in our lungs, and so the forces balance out. However, if you were to remove the air from one side of a person, then the forces would unbalance and the person would be very unhappy. So another demonstration of the power of air pressure is this. We're going to pump the air out of this 50-gallon metal drum and see what happens. There's nothing in it but air right now. Nothing in it but air. But remember, air pressure is 12 pounds per square inch. Now there's 2,500 square inches of area on this barrel. Mm -hmm. And 12 pounds per square inch adds up to 30,000 pounds of force. That's the weight of 15 cars. But there's air inside pushing out with exactly the same force. So it's equal. So it's equal and the barrel's happy. But watch what happens when we pump the air out. We've got this hose running to this vacuum pump. The gauge here will tell us the pressure inside. And let's see what happens. Yeah, actually, I'm just trying to remember the name of the one. This is the best one you've seen? This is the best one I've ever seen. Look at this. <laughs> Crushed. Boy, I wouldn't want to be in that barrel. Next time, in episode four, we'll talk about buoyancy, why helium balloons rise, and why some things float.